Oh shoot, the witch is gonna get you. All right, the witch has a jump on her. Oh man, guys. Yo, what's up you guys, it's Gossa Dudes. Welcome back, bro, to Clash of Clans. Today, we're checking out the new sneak peek, guys. And this is a new super troop that is being introduced into the game. And I think it's really awesome, this new super troop that we're getting. I'm just waiting to see and excited to see how people are gonna use this new super troop because I definitely think it's gonna, it's definitely gonna be a, a popular super troop because I know right now in the current meta, everyone's using super wall breakers and super goblins. The other two super troops, not so much. But with this super troop, I think this might actually have some uh, some new technology or some new application that we could use inside the game. So guys, if you don't know, it's gonna be the super witch. That's right, there she is. Check her out, she's looking like really cool looking. I. I must say, that is a cool looking witch costume. Um, so guys, we're gonna get into this. As you can see, her her staff is like, it has a skull on it. So I'm that's the new troop that's coming with her. I believe that's called the big boy. But guys, we're gonna get into all this. Make sure you dudes are subscribed and try to find my gift card in one of my videos because guys, I'm helping you get the skins, the new skins that are coming out. Um, for the seasons and as well guys if you are not subscribed make sure you subscribe because when my videos are released you might find the gift card to help you get the gold pass all i'm asking for guys is just use my code godson this helps me out as a content creator so that uh, i can make videos awesome like this in the future and keep videos going on this channel so thank you guys for that so let's go ahead and get into this new super troop that's coming to the game we have the new super witch guys so let's try her out let's just actually just read what she she does focused magic creates focused results instead of summoning hordes of tiny skeletons super witch summons just one really big skeleton with very formidable formidable bone density so it's a really strong troop let's just read what it what it does uh the witch has a damage per second of 360 hit points of 3200 that's really nice training cost is 915 dark elixir summon one unit so this is going to be a really strong unit. Training time is 10 minutes. All right. And it and it does ground and air, of course. Ah, there he is. There's that guy. Check that out, dudes. This is the uh, the new skeleton guy coming out of the ground. It's a bigger skeleton. I'm. You know what this is? I think that's actually a giant. She summons a giant out of the, out of the ground, and that's what he looks like. That is really cool. But we'll have to see how it looks inside the game. So let's go ahead and see if we could try her out. Let's try it out and see how this looks. We have seven, and this is a max level. So let's go. Whoa. Oh. Okay, so my witch got targeted by uh, an expo. That was a pretty far expo. And it switches over. All right, there she goes. She stays on the outside. She took some shots off. Dude, he's looking pretty nice. That's definitely a giant. You see how the way he hits? He hits with both hands. That's a giant. But is she going to spawn another one? Okay, so far she spawned one. There goes another one. All right. So, there she goes. She switched over. Okay, she went down, but the giant's still there. All right, so let's just see if we can do this. Oh, man, she's got to spawn it. So you have to kind of be careful because she doesn't spawn it right away. Ooh. But she does have a lot of hit points, so that's a good thing. Wow, this is going to be a strong team, guys. Let's just see what happens here. The witch can take some damage, though. I see that. There they go, they're getting it. Whoa, they just broke that thing. So this, the giants don't really have, um, I mean, they do have they do have some strength. They can, they can take a beating, but I think the witch, if I'm not mistaken, I have to read the stats again. The witch has a lot of health points. Look at this, she's taking like scatter shots. She's taking a lot of stuff. She's gonna get hit by the Inferno Tower or the, uh, the Eagle Artillery there. But she manages to survive. That's really nice. 
So they stay really far back away from their troops. Let's just see if she can pull up another uh, skeleton here. There they go. All right. That's really cool. We got a two star off of this. Not too bad. So if you have a super uh, super witch, you can get a two star by just spamming it in there. Have some jump spells with you and this is awesome. They'll go in and just smash everything. I must say though, guys, the the witch design looks really awesome. She's definitely a stronger witch and her clothes are pretty cool too. All right, so I mean that's the uh, that's the super witch there. I want to see. You know what I want to do? I want to try and put this character up against the uh, infernal dragon. That would be something. What wouldn't it? I mean, let's just try and put these troops up against each other and see who's stronger. Okay, guys. So we have our base ready to go. Let's just try and see if we can edit our army here. We're gonna we're gonna put in one super witch, right? We'll put in one super witch and um, actually let's do two. We'll use that and we'll save it. Let's put a rage spell just in case. And we're going to go up against a base that has an infernal dragon inside the CC. So check this out. We're going to put a witch down here. She's going to spawn her skeleton, her giant skeleton. I think its name is Big Boy. There he is. All right. So they should be able to take this down. And once the dragon's alerted, he'll come for the, the Big Boy skeleton there. Oh, shoot. The witch is going to get you. All right, the witch has a jump on her. Oh, man, guys. Oh, done. Okay, that was nice. That was nice. So let's just see what happens if we put two Infernal Dragons in there. That's going to be interesting. Let's try it out. Okay, guys, here we go. We've got uh, a couple witches here. I just want to see how this works. Let's just try and put the witch over here so that it's in range of the uh, baby dragon, or the infernal dragon, sorry. Whoa. I had to freeze them, guys. Okay, so guys, let's just try this out. We're gonna put the witch in here, and we're gonna do like two of them, because I think we're fighting against two of these infernal dragons. And they should bring, there goes the big boys. All right. Looking really detailed. I like that. That is so cool looking. Here they come. Three infernal dragons. Oh, man. Can the witches get them? Oh, shoot. Here it is. They're facing off. Oh, the witches are stronger. Hands down. Super witches have a lot of juice in them. Oh, shoot. And we're going to fight against a level 75 queen, too? There's no way. There's no way. Dudes, they just took out a queen. Man, those are some strong witches. Awesome. <laughs> I'm really liking the super witches. She's pretty dope. So let's just try and see if we can put some super witches. Let's just do a ton of super witches, uh, super witches up against a Town Hall 13. Let's try this out, guys. Okay, dudes, here we go, and I've got uh, a bunch of super witches. I have the Grand Warden. Let's just put everybody in and see what happens here. All right, we're looking good. We're looking good. Dude, this is going to be epic. They're going to go for that town hall there. Oh, they're going in. But can they actually do this? Can we get inside? We took out the town hall, but there's no jump spells. That's fine. Let's see what happens here. Super witches. Look at all these big boys. <laughs> all right. Really nice. Really strong composition. I don't think it's overpowered in any way, but it's just fun. I would say if we're going to just compare the two, I think the Infernal Dragons did a little bit, a little bit better than the um, Super Witches. But that is, of course, probably because we didn't have jump spells to go with them and the skeletons got stuck. The big boy skeletons got stuck. But I think we will still pull off a two-star nonetheless. 
I'm definitely going to try and come up with a composition to three star with all super witches. We'll have to see if that's even possible, but guys, there it is. So, the new super witch is here. What do you think about her? Is she awesome? Do you have any suggestions for me to try? Put it down in the comment box below. I'm sure we can come up with some new compositions or some ways to figure out how we could use this troop. So guys, thank you so much for watching. This is Godson. Be sure to check me out on the next episode and I will see you there. Godson out.